Do you know that Africa has the highest concentration of mineral resources of any continent with 30% of the world's entire mineral reserve? Knowing this, the first question that should come to your mind is, why isn't Africa the richest continent? Well, that's a topic for another day. As the human ecological footprint of Africa grew relentlessly, the sustainable management of mineral resources has become a major issue. Africa is made up of the most divergent and converging countries because of their wealth of soil and subsoil. But it is surprising that the countries richest in mineral resources are amongst the poorest, economically speaking, except for a few. Here are the top 10 highest mineral producing countries in Africa. Stay tuned. Ghana Ghana's export trade is significantly bolstered by its mineral riches. 37% of total exports are minerals. Ghana is Africa's second largest producer of gold after South Africa and holds more than 15% of the continent's supply. Of the country's mineral exports, gold contributes more than 90%. Ghana can owe their successes to establishing more golden mines with modern facilities. Alongside gold, Ghana is also endowed with deposits of iron ore, limestone, columbite tantalite, feldspar, quartz and salt, and there are also minor deposits of lemonite, magnetite and rutile. Democratic Republic of Congo DR Congo has one of the richest deposits of mineral resources in the world and since 1960, DR Congo has been known for its mineralization as one of the most industrialized countries in Africa. DR Congo is estimated to have more than $24 trillion worth of untapped mineral ore deposits, but even so, it remains one of the greatest producers of diamonds and copper in Africa. Other raw minerals DR Congo houses are oil, coltan, cobalt, gold, and tin ore. However, DR Congo continues to suffer from corruption and crime, and has been forced to shut down many mining operations to curb illegal activity. Gabon For many years, the oil industry has been the driving engine behind Gabon's rising economy. However, the mining sector has witnessed substantial progress since the country's independence. Gabon is the world's fourth largest producer of manganese, with reserves of 150 million tons and production of 1.8 million tons in 2015. The country has more than 2 billion tons of iron ore, over 40 tons of proven gold reserve, and a range of other rare earth minerals including lead, zinc, copper, diamonds, niobium, and titanium. The mining industry of Gabon stagnated during a short period in 2015. The untapped potential of this sector got diversified by governmental plans to boost GDP contribution to over 30% in the upcoming 15 years. Libya Situated in the north of Africa and sharing a border to the west with fellow OPEC member country Algeria, Libya is the 16th largest country in the world in terms of landmass comprising around 1,760 square kilometers. Apart from petroleum, Libya's other natural resources are natural gas, gold, magnesium, and gypsum. Its economy depends primarily on the oil sector. Substantial revenues from the energy sector coupled with a small population give Libya one of the highest per capita GDPs in Africa. Angola Angola is one of the most promising countries in Africa with respect to mineral resource development. It is currently the biggest deep water offshore producer in Africa and has potential to become a major force in production of gem quality diamonds as well as other mineral resources. There are large reserves of iron ore in the southwestern part of the country, but they are of low grade. Other minerals, copper, manganese, gold, phosphates, uranium, feldspar, and platinum are known to exist in commercial quantities in Angola especially in the area of the escarpments. Egypt Egypt is home to a wealth of mineral resources including gold, copper, silver, zinc, platinum and a number of other precious and base metals. These resources all lie beneath Egypt's eastern desert and the Sinai Peninsula, both part of a geological setting known as the Arabian Nubian Shield. With an estimated 6.7 million ounces of gold, 48 million tons of tantalite, of which it has the fourth largest reserve in the world, and 50 million tons of coal, Egypt has the potential to be the top mining jurisdictions in the world. Predicted to be one of the most powerful economies by 2030, Egypt owns major gas fields in the Mediterranean. 
proceeds from mining has aided the country to make structural investments in various sectors, including power generation and the establishment of numerous industrial zones. Guinea Bauxite, iron ore, gold and diamond mining represent key markets for Guinea and relatively well developed with tens of foreign companies actively producing and exporting minerals. In addition to these resources, Guinea has commercially viable quantities of graphite, manganese, nickel and uranium, though these reserves have not yet been exploited commercially. In 2020, Guinea exported just over $3.3 billion worth of bauxite and $1.2 billion worth of gold. Large amounts of high-quality iron ore remain unexploited due to the logistical difficulty of transporting ore to ports. Two new iron ore projects at Simandu and Mount Nimba are likely to begin exporting within the next three years over the mining site and associated rail lines have been completed. Algeria Algeria, a country of 44 million people, is the largest and one of the wealthiest countries in Africa. The Algerian economy is heavily reliant on hydrocarbon revenues and the sector is the backbone of the Algerian economy. Algeria remains mainly underexplored as regards to non-hydrocarbon mineral deposits. The country enjoys a huge untapped potential for several minerals including iron ore, phosphates, gold, copper, zinc, lead, marble, bentonite, barite, manganese, wolframite and other useful minerals. Most of the country's mining potential, including minerals and rare earth, remains insufficiently accessed. Iron ore and phosphate rock are currently the only minerals that have been produced in the country on a large scale. Nigeria One of the most essential economies of the continent, Nigeria is the leading producer and exporter of crude oil. Also, it is the fifth oil producer in the world in OPEC. Oil thus represents 40% of the country's gross domestic product. Alongside its plentiful oil reserves, Nigeria boasts gold, columbite, wolframite, tantalite, bitumen, iron ore and uranium. Incredibly, Nigeria's mining industry remains vastly underdeveloped, however, and only accounts for 0.3% of the country's GDP, indicating huge opportunities in the years ahead. South Africa Sitting comfortably at the top of the continent's mineral pile is South Africa. South Africa has been the richest economy on the continent in large part thanks to its enormous mining industry. While diamonds and gold constituted the largest portion of South Africa's initial mining interest, the discovery of many other minerals allowed the country to diversify its investments. South Africa is the world's largest producer of chrome, manganese, platinum, vanadium, and vermiculite, and the second largest producer of ilmenite, palladium, rutal, and zirconium. The country is significantly the largest mineral producer in the African continent, but despite all the positive omens, mining companies are in a tough operating environment with high levels of crime, expensive and irregular electricity supply, and logistical bottlenecks on rail and ports, and there is a backlog of around 4,000 mining and exploration permits. The mineral industry is a significantly important source of export earnings for many African nations. To promote exports, Groups of African countries have formed numerous trade blocks, which includes the Common Market for Eastern and Southern Africa, the Economic and Monetary Community of Central Africa, the Economic Community of Central African States, the Economic Community of West African States. The list goes on. I hope you enjoyed this video. Kindly comment, like, and share. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.